this? Come on. You used to do this. Silly. Come on. I'm reasonable. Can you get? Keep your feet off there. Wow! Go on, I dare you. Wear it the right way around. Put on that Sunday allowance on me. At last, a woman with the right priorities. I've been searching for one all my life. You really like it? You look absolutely gorgeous. Honest. The only woman in Ashford who could stop traffic going in both directions. Where are we going, kids? Oh, really? Everything's in the wrong boxes. It clearly says books. Darling. Mm hmm? It's on your phone today. Mm hmm? You know she's rushed off her feet. She's asked me to join her. I could use my French. She's just got this contract with an engineering firm, something to do with the Channel Tunnel. You want to work full time? Not all the time. You short of cash? Not really. I don't earn enough? No. I mean, yes. What have I done wrong? Nothing. What's wrong with me? What do you mean? And I know I could be doing something better than this. But what can I do? It's nothing to do with that. What about the children? Well, now Bobby's at school, I can fit it in. I've spoken to Mark. Oh, I see. You're presenting me with a fait accompli now. No. <sighs> I just... See, you don't speak to me first. I am. Now. Now, yes. You don't love your children. Of course. I don't have to be with them all day. For Christ's sake, you were brought up by an ayah. You're always saying a wonderful thing. Marion, you know nothing about that. What do you mean? Oh, please. Don't make a fuss. Not this time. That's our Excelsior, which is in phase two, which is under construction. There's uh, two bathrooms, one en suite, choice of three tile finishes. Yes. Thank you. Goodbye. I passed. You have. <clears throat> You've been celebrating. Only a tiny one. Come on. Can I take you for a spin? Go on, mate. Third time lucky, eh? How did you do it? Just a quick knee tremble with the tester. <laughs> it's okay, we didn't break the speed limit. <laughs> Come on. Oh, 
Diane, what did you just mean? Nothing. I wish you wouldn't say things like that. It makes me look so... Oh, don't be so... I'm sorry. Come on. Where do you want to go? I don't know. <clears throat> Anywhere you like. used to read you words with? Long favoured England, be thou not misled by monstrous theories of alien growth. <laughs> <laughs> Something like the beating and build on. What? In there. Your new estate. Why do you have to spoil it? Ten years older. <clears throat> Anything's possible now. This France. This the world. <laughs> oh, I've been dumb. Ah, oh, well, the fond of it myself. You didn't have to go up there. I told you the high spot in my childhood was spitting competitions in the bus shelter. But you have us now. You have our home. I oh, know, I love it. I used to be a romantic, you know. I used to go. What about you? So you seem so... Je t'adore. Tu es la plus grande mort. What does that mean? In view of the dishes, man, in the world. I get to move the chola. I to move my room. Just give up. And what's that mean? That means if you ever leave me, I'll kill you first, and then I'll kill myself. Hi. Hello. There's a parcel for you from Karachi. Your mother doesn't give up, does she? I forgot to send her a card for Reed. Still find it weird to know a bloke with a tailor. I told you. I mean, he's used him for years. Stitching is superb. <laughs> no, honestly, it's lovely. I went to school and they knocked all the nonsense out of me, and then I went to Oxford and they knocked it all back. You know? <laughs> I mean, I think what it Shit! I sold my booty for that. Tracy will babysit. Oh, please, I have to finish Bobby's room. It's going to take me until Christmas the way I'm going. I'm so please come. You go. No, I won't if you don't. But don't be silly. Huh? Don't want to. Look, I don't mind. I'd rather be here with the kids. Oh, please, come. We'll never go out. I mean, you don't seem to understand. People aren't quite so hysterically funny when you're only drinking pineapple juice. Especially us friends. Oh, let's go out alone, then. We just stay here and go together like we used to, remember? Candlelight, soft music. Touch me in front of the table, if you like. All right. Well, don't sound so thrilled. Yeah, yeah, I said all right. Let's do, huh? Don't bother. I said all right. Get on with your bloody shelves. Hi. 
figured you still can't come to London tomorrow. I'm sorry. Oh, Carol, I forgot the cling film. Nowadays, you seem to be cooking for everybody except your own family. My family doesn't pay me. That's Sonia talking. You're getting more and more like her every day. I'm sorry. Do you think she has anything ordinary, like fish fingers and chips? <laughs> uh, what's the matter? Tastes horrible. Mine's all right. Spill it. <laughs> Got cat food in it. Oh yeah, that's right. Pity cat. You know why, don't you? Make some feel at home. Go on, children. It's time to go. Did I say something? <laughs> What's the matter? Asked Piggy. It's a very funny thing, said Bear. But there seem to be two animals now. Go on. This whatever it was has been joined by another whatever it is. And the two of them are now proceeding in company. Would you mind coming with me, Piglet? In case they turn out to be hostile animals? Chartered survey is not a pretty sight. Why did you leave us today? I had to. How was London? Fine. The kids behave themselves? Mm hmm. Oh, please don't be angry. I'm not. You are. You're all huffy. You. Come here. Thank you. Children. Bobby. Jasmine. And she's not. She's getting deaf. They should have been with you where they belong. Look, women do this now. I was here all day listening to Jill tell me one more time about Emily's wide vocabulary. I'd be locked up in a loony bin. I 
and then you'd look after the kids. Bringing up children is the most important job in the world. Then why aren't men doing it? You know why? Because if they did, they'd go round the bend. What's happening to you? You're starting to sound like my father. How are you? Hi, Here with the remains of our sister headmaster's oh. annual buffet. Mm. Ooh, there's no smoked salmon left. Thanks, but. Uh, oh, thank well, of course you do. You can do that. Hey. Boys, I've got the bath. Thank you. I've got the bath. Yeah. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to मैं तुम्हारा सलाम दे दूं, बिल्कुल। तुम उनसे मिलने क्यों नहीं जाते? तुमको मालूम है क्यों? वो बच्चे को मिलना चाहेंगे। Right, let's play cricket. Right, you both. Just throw it at me. <laughs> ready? I'm ready. Bobby. Okay. <laughs> Tasty, aren't they? Mm. Nice and slim. Nice, firm, little bombs. <laughs> I could do with a quick bunk up without his ease. Really? It's been six weeks. I'm starting to hyperventilate when I see a cucumber. And you really fancy him? Just for the one night, mind. You should just use a man for his body. It's much less disappointing in the long run. <laughs> You've been very quiet lately. Have I? He's changed, hasn't he, since the kids? Got more, well... Salimish. I'd do anything for a man that made me laugh. Anything.
our vending machines breath again. Hint, hint. So, are I? Like a sledgehammer. Kevin Keegan perm. On D. On D. You don't know anything, do you? No. I come from a poor, deprived background. No excuse. So do I. We had an outside toilet. Oh, we didn't even have a toilet. We didn't even have a TV. We used to sit around looking at our friend rent arrears. Rent arrears? We didn't even have a house. Nor did we. I'm just pretending. Ah, oh, but the community spirit. Ah, oh, yeah. Hancock's a half hour. Bonnet. Who was she? Jim Winfield. Cars and little indicators that flipped up on the side. Somewhere to park. Van Fritters. Young Beagle. Playtex Girdles. Whoa. Playtex Girdles. Do you know something? What? I used to be a front bug. Boring. Conventional. That's before I saw your back. Really? Really? You uh, always take things that don't belong to you? Yeah. Well, you shouldn't. It's the even gearbox. Terry? Oh, yeah? You free tomorrow to take us to a wedding? What time? 10.30. I am. Ah, oh, good. Bye. Thanks for the coffee. Ten three tomorrow, Sonia. Can we do it all over again? Hey, that hurts. Anyway, you get fed up with me. You can always marry another one. How many are you allowed? I've forgotten. Don't ever say that. <laughs> Why not? Because from the first moment I saw you in the corridor. I had planned it all, you know. I knew you belonged to me. That's a lot, Terry. That's a lot, Sonia. Thank you. Work or home? What did he say? Work. 
But that doesn't mean anything. He probably thinks I'm married. Should we keep this? Philistines. Still, waste not, want not. They made short work of that Creole chicken as per usual. <laughs> Poor sods. The party's over. It's time to wash it off. What's up, sweetheart? Nothing. What is it? It's weddings, innit? You should have seen my mum at mine. You should have seen mine. <laughs> yeah, mine has something to cry about. That's better. Do you have something? First time I saw you, you had your hair done up with us at Red Combs. You remember? Oh, I didn't think people noticed anymore. Well, that's a shame. Did they used to? I suppose so, once. You are ever so beautiful. Am I? And you've got the sexiest elbows in South East England. I've been wanting to tell you that for weeks. Yeah? Ain't you noticed? You've always looked like a fast worker to me. Yeah. Well, in this case, it's different. Isn't it? It's not looking like that. I'm not. I'm very happy, see? So you can shut up. Don't take me back. All of it? Just, uh, you know, such a mess. 
The lounge looks nice, too. Shall I get you some tea? Thank you. Marianne? What? There's something I want to say. What? I feel we ought to talk. Talk? I think you know about what. What do you mean? It's about us. Us? I thought seeing as the children aren't here, now's a good time. For what? To discuss it. Now that we've got this place. What do you mean? Having another baby. Look, we always said we shouldn't wait forever. Look, let's not talk about it now. We never want to talk I'm about it. I'm just so busy. I know, but... I mean, I love having a job. You're always grumbling. Everybody grumbles about their work. That's why they're married. Have someone to grumble to. Look, we'll talk about it later. But I... Have some ginger cake. I bought it specially. Look, talking about my job... Mm. You know I'm doing this dinner party tonight. This woman, she's entertaining some foreign clients. She told me. Japanese, I think. They're setting up some electronics factory. Anyway, I've uh, got to serve and everything, so I might be back a bit late. I know, you said. There's supper in the fridge. That's just what I mean. Don't. Please? Sorry. I'll read them Baba the Elephant. I used to love it myself. Oh, so nice. Mom, what are you doing? Just coming. You look nice. Do I? Watch out for those Japs. What? Japanese. Oh, yeah. Can't trust these foreigners, you know. Don't wait up. Hello, Bobby. Come on, big boys don't need this anymore. It's quite chintzel. Oh. Hi. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, God. I have to charge your mileage, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. How far then? Oh, about two hundred. Bigger. <laughs> like twenty. <laughs> <laughs> I call it quits at forty five. Mm. <sighs> previous owners. Yeah, I'm accounting. So, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to go to an office in a car, like you do. Heavens, I didn't. What's the time? Shh. How long have we got? I'll be. Don't think about it. Now, what'd you give them? Avocado mousse. Yeah. Birth Wellington. <laughs> and creme brulee. Excellent. Top of the class. <clears throat> I didn't mean this to happen. Honest. Not like this. Nor did I. <sighs> oh. Found out he'd kill me. He's got an awful temper. So 
Sometimes I feel I don't know him at all. Well, that's what made him so attractive in the first place. Oh, look, babe, you were ever so young. You were dying to get away from home. Along came Sally. Mom went the old Moscow and you were a goner. I'm frightened. I'm here with an inexhaustible supply of alibis. He must think we're ever so successful, all those dinners. He'll be wanting to buy shares in us soon. Well, we met at evening classes. Just arrived from Pakistan. And we had such a posh family. We're studying poetry, Pope and all that. Pope? Oh. Anybody play for? Oh, shut up. Anyways, I fell for him. Okay, okay, cut that bit. It's never been like this. It seems strange, you know, you being married to blah blah blah. Why? Well, you know. never really seemed foreign until I met you. No, Mom! No! It's very nice, isn't it, Malcolm? We'll go back and do our sums. Thank you. If there's any more information you require, please don't hesitate to call. and ever so pretty. Yes, she is. She came into our shop last month. Didn't she? Such an unusual name, isn't it? Come along, Leslie. Well? Sorry? The watch. Did you like it? Oh, yes. Thank you very much.
Please and clean your room, please. Hi. Now. I'll be up in ten minutes and I will see it completely clean. I don't want to. Go! <laughs> Hello. Who is he? What? Who is he? Who is who? Don't lie, whore. What do you mean? Where is your diaphragm? Uh, Where is your bloody diaphragm, you horse? Oh, oh, don't want the children to know mummy is a slut, huh? Don't. Who is the man? Or is it men? What? How many? No. How many? No. Tell me. Two? No. Three? Four? No. Five? Six? No. Seven? No. One. One. It's only one. Only one, huh? Only one. Do you mind telling me how long this has been going on? Don't. How long? Not long. How long? Not long! How long? How long? Three months. Three months. Where? 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 In my bed? You're disgusting! gone to a friend's. Have you got any friends here? Oh, son, you should have seen him. Don't worry. He's safe here. Oh, God! Don't let him in. Look, get into the kitchen. I'll deal with this. Tell him I'm not here. I take it you want a divorce. We can't. I just... said, I take it you want a divorce. Do you? Of course. I've made some preliminary arrangements. I found myself somewhere to live. I moved there on Monday. Celine. So, um, don't worry, until then I'll sleep down here on the settee. I didn't mean that. I would like it if it is at all possible for you to behave yourself in front of the children over the weekend. Of course. It's not too much to ask. Do you think you could manage that? But uh, what about... In my opinion, though obviously not in yours, the children are our first concern. Of course they are. But so, may I suggest, over the next few days, we keep everything as pleasant as possible. Celine. I've spoken to my lawyer. I would advise you to make an appointment with yours. I haven't got a lawyer. That's all I have to say. Now I'd like to go and see the children. It was delicious. Mm. 
hungry, darling? Come on, children. Bedtime. <coughs> night, Mum. Night, Mum. Darling, I think I'll sleep downstairs tonight. I've got a call to come. When does Terry get back from Birmingham? Tomorrow. Unless Salim gets to him first. She doesn't know who he is. I was only joking. I'm going to take them out after work. We'll go to the Wimpy and I'll explain it all to them. That their daddy's moving out. That they'll see him at weekends. So upset. Perhaps I should just phone the school and see how he is. Mary Ann, Sorry to interrupt you. I've come to get Bobby for his dentist appointment. Dentist? Didn't his mother tell you? Yeah. Oh dear. Never mind. Mrs. Brown, sorry to interrupt you. Bring me for Bobby, please. Yes, of course. Bobby, would you like to go along? Thank you. Where's your coat? Where's Yasmin's class? It's the laundry. They lost the tablecloth. Mm. Bobby. Where is he? He's gone. What? His father came to take him to the dentist. Hours ago. <laughs> 